God's word is powerful because it has a purpose in our lives. The psalmist says, Yahweh's word is perfect in every way, how it revives our souls. Yahweh's laws lead us to truth, and His ways change the simple into wise. Yahweh's teachings are right and make us joyful. His precepts are so pure. Yahweh's commands challenge us to keep close to His heart. The revelation light of His word makes my spirit shine radiant. Yahweh's decrees are trustworthy. The fear of Yahweh is pure, enduring forever. The rarest treasures of life are found in His truth. That is why God's word is prized like others prize the finest gold. By listening daily to His word, may His love be more felt in your daily life. A reading from the letter of Paul to the Ephesians. Brothers and sisters, be kind to one another, compassionate, forgiving one another as God has forgiven you in Christ. Be imitators of God as beloved children and live in one, as Christ loved us and handed himself over for us as a sacrificial offering to God for a fragrant aroma. Immorality or any impurity or greed must not even be mentioned among you, as is fitting among holy ones. No obscenity or silly or suggestive talk, which is out of place, but instead thanksgiving. Be sure of this, that no immoral or impure or greedy person that is an idolater, has any inheritance in the kingdom of Christ and of God. Let no one deceive you with empty arguments, for because of these things, the wrath of God is coming upon the disobedient. So do not be associated with them, for you were once darkness, but now you are light in the Lord. Live as children of light. Responsorial Psalm Behave like God as his very dear children. Blessed the man who follows not the counsel of the wicked, nor walks in the way of sinners, nor sits in the company of the insolent, but delights in the law of the Lord, and meditates on his law day and night. Behave like God as his very dear children. He is like a tree planted near running water that yields its fruit in due season and whose leaves never fade. Whatever he does, prospers. Behave like God as his very dear children. Not so the wicked, not so. They are like chaff which the wind drives away. For the Lord watches over the way of the just but the way of the wicked vanishes. Behave like God as his very dear children. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke. Jesus was teaching in the synagogue on the Sabbath, and a woman was there who for 18 years had been crippled by a spirit. She was bent over, completely incapable of standing erect. When Jesus saw her, he called her and said, Woman, you are set free of your infirmity. He laid his hands on her. And she at once stood up straight and glorified God. But the leader of the synagogue, indignant that Jesus had cured on the Sabbath, 
said to the crowd in reply, There are six days when work should be done. Come on those days to be cured, not on the Sabbath day. The Lord said to him in reply, Hypocrites, do not each one of you on the Sabbath untie his ox or his ass from the manger and lead out for watering? This daughter of Abraham, whom Satan had bound for eighteen years now, ought she not to have been set free on the Sabbath day from this bandage? When he said this, all his adversaries were humiliated, and the whole crowd rejoiced at all the splendid deeds done by him. Let us pray. Almighty, ever-living God, increase our faith, hope, and charity, and make us love what you command, so that we may merit what you promise. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. Amen.